Are you not Elizabeth Salanda, the writer of wrongs? The girl who hurts men, who hurt women. It's weird because I, I, I usually uh, with every director, we set up a, a very detailed book of the look and everything. But with Fede, uh, it is way more like you know intuitive and natural. I remember like when we were we were like months away of starting. I was talking with this um, post-production coordinator and uh, John Pornoy. Uh, we were discussing cameras. We were having lunch, and uh, and he said. And I was thinking, like, I think I would like to use a 65. And, and he said, why not? I don't know. It's the best camera ever. <laughs> he said, like, it's like, OK. And um, when I tested it, I thought it was great. But the beautiful thing is the magnification. When you put a 50 and you have the field of view of a 25, but the compression of a 50. And also, that kind of makes the, uh, in a way, the characters live in the spaces a little bit uh, uh, more, you know, because having like a, like that wide angle, that's not a wide angle because it's a 50, uh, it makes the characters be a little bit closer to the background, but at the same time has that beautiful depth of field, you know, that's very shallow. Um, and I just fell in love with it. We were in Ari Berlin. And, um, and I wanted to test lenses. And literally, I tried every lens we had. I tried Leica Talias. I tried Cook S7s. I tried, um, and then I tried all the Ari lenses. I tried the 765s, the Prime 65s, the S65s, the Prime DNAs. And what happened, what I felt was like, um, that I, re I was really interested in the, in the magnification thing, you know, in the big sensor, like medium format uh, uh, feel, but I didn't want it to have that sharpness. So the prime DNAs were a little bit softer and a little bit more forgiving, you know, with skin and with stuff in general. And also, they were fast, and there was a huge collection of them. I think the ones we used the most were the 80, and, uh, and I think the 55. The 55 was, uh, it's a great lens. It's a great lens because you, it allows you to get closer to stuff without being too wide, but it has a, such a wonderful 3D quality. But actually, we, I use them all. I love them all. The most beautiful thing I found about those lenses and, and this format is that it's a little bit counterintuitive because when you use it indoors in small locations, it looks better. Because you can put a 28 and you see the, the, the whole place, but with still the compression of a 28, if you have the, the angle of a 14, which is huge, you see everything, but it's not so deformed. It doesn't look like a fisheye. It was great to work with Ari Rental. I mean, we modified lenses. That's something beautiful. We, all the, all the lenses that had anything that we wanted to change, or we wanted to try something else, we were able to send them back, or and 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 and, um, and we had such a huge. Um, it was a big team, you know. We had a lot of cameras, a lot of lenses, and uh, and every, everything was perfect. It was there working and uh, on time? Yeah. Why is it this bad? Why is it spiders don't get stuck in their own webs? Thank you.